of the most common questions that I get asked when somebody is arrested or stopped for a DUI is what's going to happen with my driver's license. The truth is, in Arizona and in many other states, there is a two-part process. One part is the criminal charge that makes its way through the criminal court system. The other part is the administrative license suspension that moves through the Department of Motor Vehicles. Today, I want to focus on only the administrative license suspension that occurs through your state's motor vehicle division. At the time of your arrest for a DUI in Arizona, the officer may serve you with a notice of suspension of your driver's license. That notice of suspension becomes effective 30 days after it has been served on you. What a lot of people don't realize is they have the opportunity to challenge that suspension. And you can do that by requesting a hearing through the Motor Vehicle Division. When you request a hearing with Motor Vehicle, that stays or stops that suspension from going into place. And then you have an opportunity to challenge or levy an attack against that suspension. So if you've been arrested for a DUI in Arizona, there are two things that you really need to keep in mind. Number one, that license suspension process may continue to move forward even though you may have not been formally charged with a DUI just yet. And number two, whether to challenge the suspension with the Motor Vehicle Division is really something that you need to consult with a, an attorney about to make sure that you're exercising the right option.